Hi, welcome to this quick video overview of our Unity Suite, a brand new add-on that unlocks social learning in your Skyper platform. Let's dive in and check out what your learners will see when they access Unity. The first page is a home page where learners will see their recently viewed content as well as content that's been recently uploaded to collections they belong to. My library is where learners can pin things for easy access. They can also make their own folders for easy organization. Next up is collections. This area displays the folders that the user has access to. The search bar in the collection will only search the current folder the learner is in. However, the search bar at the top is general and will search everything, including the folders and discussion posts. Social groups are the connected groups in Skyprep. Within the groups, learners will be able to access content that's been assigned or added to the group, as well as see and participate in group discussions. When a learner clicks on a document, they'll be taken to its page. The document is shown on the left side, while the discussion panel is shown on the right. Users can post comments or select the post as a question option to allow others to respond and provide answers. Admins will see a button in the bottom left corner of their screen if there are any questions that require attention to resolve. Now we'll move over to the admin side and cover how to set Unity up. Starting off in the training elements area, click on Unity. This area will contain all of your folders for your collections, as well as the content within them. To create a collection, just click on the new collection button in the upper right and give it a name. If you want to further organize your collection, you can use a new folder button to create a folder inside your current folder. Just like in Skyprep, adding content to Unity is done using the Add Material button. Once material has been added, you'll need to give users access to view it. This is done by using the Users and Enrollments button. In the Users tab, you can select individual users who should be able to access the collection or entire groups using the Groups tab. If enroll in groups, every group member will receive access. Alternatively, you can enable the publicly available setting to give everyone on your platform access. Regarding groups in Unity, you have several additional options available which are all access to the Groups page in Skyprep. When you view a group, you'll see two tabs, Unity Collections and Unity Social. In the Unity Collections tab, here you can assign collections to the group. The Unity Social tab has options for enabling social interactions within the group. Once enabled, you'll be able to toggle the ability for the group to have its own discussion area and or allow its members to see a list of other group members. Similar to how the groups area contains some Unity specific settings, you'll also find Unity settings in your courses. After clicking on a course, you'll see the Unity Integration tab. Here you can opt to mirror the course into a collection. By doing so, the course modules will be added to the collections that you specify. Additionally, any changes that you make to the course content in Skyper will be made in Unity as well, allowing you to easily update content regardless of where it is. You can choose to either mirror all the modules or only specific ones. There's also an option to add users in the course to a collection. This is a great option if you want to allow course discussion or want to provide additional reference material. When using this option, you'll be able to choose which collections they get access to, and for each collection, you can specify the access rules. Specifically, they can gain access once they are enrolled, once they have started, or once they have passed the course. Now that we've covered the basics of using Unity, if you have any additional questions, you can click on the button in the bottom right corner of your screen to send us a message, or you can speak with your account manager for more assistance.